Hi, I'm Colleen Taylor, and you're watching Cribs, the TechCrunch TV series where we go to some of the hottest tech companies and take a tour of their offices and see what it's like inside. Today, I'm in the Jackson Square neighborhood of San Francisco, and we're visiting the headquarters of Weebly. Weebly is the startup that lets you build your own websites and blogs really easily. Weebly now powers 15 million websites out there. So uh, we've heard that the company's office is pretty cool, so we're going to go and take a look inside. Hi. Thanks. Hi. Nice to meet you. Hey. Thanks for coming. Yes. Yeah. This is David Rusenko, mm -hmm. CEO of Weebly. Mm -hmm. Thanks for having us here. Absolutely. Yeah. Great. Should, should we take a tour around the office? Let's take a tour. First, maybe you could just tell me um, who this is. <laughs> this is Lucy, our, our company mascot. Hi, Lucy. She's an English bulldog and hangs out here a whole bunch. Keep the place pretty safe. Exactly. <laughs> cool. Uh, she's not much of a guard dog. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> she looks intimidating, though. So this is our lobby here. Um, you know, basically, you know, I, we actually have a couple cool displays. Um, this first display is actually people using Weebly right now. So you can see, you know, all those little dots flashing uh, are people who are dragging things on, editing their website in real time. And over here, we just kind of have a, a quick slideshow of websites. You know, kind of cool stuff people built on Weebly. Cool. Yeah. So let's let's take a look around. So we kind of have this open office area here. Um, basically, you know, open plan. This is where everyone sits. This is kind of our main conference uh, boardroom over here. We actually have both of our uh, other founders, Dan and Chris. Hey, guys. Hey. This I is uh, Crib Screw here. I think we're crashing a meeting uh, here. Uh, <laughs> this is Dan, uh, my co-founder, and uh, also Chris. Uh, Dan heads up product. Chris heads up uh, technology and infrastructure. And we actually have our New York office on the, uh, on the line over here. This is Nick over in New York. Is it five o'clock somewhere in New York? Yeah, we, 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 we got a keg right <laughs> in New York, so, so Nick cracked open a beer. If we take a look over to the left, um, we'll see this uh, old blocked off tunnel system, which is kind of cool. So, so we've turned this into a, um, just kind of a quiet area where you come and think, but this actually, as far as we know, leads to a tunnel system under North Beach. Not too many people talk about it. It's back from old bootlegging days, kind of the prohibition days. And you know, one of our engineers knows there's still a draft coming through, so the tunnels are definitely still open. That's a little creepy. Yeah, yeah. I mean, luckily they filled it with concrete, so I don't think anyone's getting through there anytime soon. What does this building date back to? I mean, these bricks are obviously pretty old. It dates back to 1904, actually. A lot of this stuff is original. The bricks are original. The wood that we saw um, up in the lobby is also original. They managed to just redo that and refinish it. It looks really great. Can I see if there's anything I'm afraid I'm going to push on this, and then it'll all tumble. No, this is there's a massive amount of concrete. We actually we actually thought you know, um, you know our engineers been talking about like how do we get this out there and go explore the tunnels, and um, you know basically it's going to take dynamite to get rid of this. So that's that, that's not happening. I think I can hear ghosts. <laughs> ghosts of prohibition past. <laughs> cool. So as we keep walking down, um, you know we we have you know kind of just a different groups in different areas. I mean you know, Dan and I sit over there. Um, you know, we have support over here. Uh, we have, um, you know, our ops operations team over here um, and uh, finance team. So everyone just kind of sits out in this open area here. I'm also noticing you guys have some firearms. We do. That's, it's really important for, for self-defense, you know. When, <laughs> they when, look pretty serious. Yes. So, you know, upstairs is kind of all about work, but downstairs is uh, more all about fun. Just a peek in here. We actually have uh, twice a month. We have people getting massages, uh, so we might nice. be able to squeeze you in at the end. That looks amazing. Down here we have um, kind of the kitchen, um, you know, hangout area. So, you know. Ping pong, pool, foosball. Um, you know, lunch and dinner catered in every day. Um, you know, a lot of fun stuff going on. You know, the TVs are for presentation and all hands. Um, something really cool I want to show you over here, actually. So we don't show a lot, a lot of people this area, but um, you know, if you if you have the key card access, 
come in here. We have a mini data center in here. So, you know, this is this is where we host Weebly. So this is where all those 15 million websites. No, no absolutely not. <laughs> <laughs> no, we actually have multiple redundant data centers. Um, you know, kind of scattered across the U.S. But this is just uh, this is just for our office. Okay. So, yeah. So this is where the magic happens. Yeah, really. this is this is you know on a much larger scale. This is what our data centers look like. Yeah. You know the the business purpose of the speakers and the TVs is definitely for all hands and kind of connecting our multiple offices. But um, but you know a secondary purpose is you know all this DJ gear. I mean, this is my personal gear that I brought over, you know, kind of multiple generations all the way from the actual vinyl to CDs to now the digital stuff that literally just plugs into your laptop via USB. So you do the real vinyl, you're, you're a real DJ, you're not one of these iPod guys. Well, I, this is what I got started on. Um, but, but actually, this, you know, this stuff, they're making a lot of progress. It's actually uh, some really cool stuff, four channels going at the same time. So if you ever come to our Christmas party, uh, which obviously you're invited, um, you, you can kind of hear me play. What's your, what's your favorite? Record in this whole stack. Uh, oh, my favorite record. Is oh, wow, you've got the Chronic. Is this the Chronic? There, there's definitely some classic stuff in there, but there's some old school. Like this one's pretty good. There's some old school uh, electronic music that you know probably be hard to find these days. Nice. So the, I mean, then this is really cool. You know, we spent a lot of time, um, a lot of time building out this bookshelf. It's actually custom made. Uh, it's walnut. We had someone from uh, Oakland build this out, and we actually you know also put a lot of effort into the library. So we had you know gave people Amazon cards and have everyone you know, choose books and, and really build this out. So it's, it's really nice the way it turned out. Over here is the special book that, that, that matters the most. And if you pull this book, the whole thing slides out. A secret passageway. I'm now, so excited right I now. Can't, I can't let the cameras back here because it's, it's company policy that you have to come into the office to see it in the secret room, but they could take a peek inside and, and, and I'll show you what's in here. Okay. This is awesome. So what happens back here? Poker, you know, guys come back, pick poker. It's just kind of a hangout area for parties. Yeah. Nice, it yeah. smells of rich leather and mahogany. <laughs> <sighs> that was amazing. <laughs> I mean, platonically. <laughs> Anyways, well, so which book is it? Uh, it's, it's actually Hitchhiker's Guide to the Galaxy, which is a team's choice. Maybe we'll take you back over here. I think um, you know, definitely want to take a peek at the shower because that is very cool. So go ahead in. Okay. Oh, and check it out. <laughs> Should I take a towel? Follow me into the bathroom. There's the shower. This is nice. I'm not going to turn it on. Pretty spa atmosphere in here. Steam it up. There's a book too for reading The Theory of the Leisure Class. Oh, there you are. I lost you. Um, looks like you found the spot though. So, um, you know, whenever you're ready, show yourself out. Thanks, David. See ya. Thanks for stopping by.